Today I'm going to be reviewing Lethal Company. It's a new game. Uh, it is a co-op game. It is a single player game. Multiplayer slash game. Uh, let's go ahead and get into it and uh, watch and review. The company is high, high, high. You'll have your... So the first thing it says is this company is hiring. So it does feel like it's a digital kind of work. And I don't like work, so that already kind of throws me off. I'm getting some weird vibes. But the ratings are great in this game, so we can't judge too harshly. Very own shit. Your very own crew. The graphics wise kinda of looks like Borderlands, which is okay. Crew. Your job. Collect worthless garbage. The audio sounds alright. It sounds mediocre at most. To return to the company desk. It's easy. So I'm gathering it's a loot kind of game and a survival slash game. And the last person to survive the longest wins. Okay, so we can already see it's collecting like lanterns. So probably like an energy source to power the ship. Because you do get a ship. You do get a bunch of power sources. You do have some kind of like weapons. And you have some scanning devices you get to use. Okay, so it's an interesting concept. It looks like there are some alien creatures as well, and it's a very dark kind of game. I don't know, I'm getting alien kind of vibes. Yeah, so I'm not really sure if I'm going to be playing this game. I just, it looks cool, and I think it'll be fun to watch other people play it. Especially a lot of people in the same lobby, I think it'll be really cool. Um, I don't think I'm going to play it, because it kind of reminds me of, like, like I said, Borderlands mixed with... Um, that game. Yeah, so... I would probably give this game probably like 7 out of 10 at most, maybe 6, 7 out of 10. Uh, but like I said, it'd be fun to watch people play this game, for sure. I just play it myself? Maybe. I don't know if I can really get into it, though. But that's just my opinion, people. Later.